Okay, hey collective. Um, I went off camera to give you guys a general spread for today. Uh, remember collective, this spread that I pulled here for you guys, this is a general timeless spread, all right? So for some of you guys, some of these messages that I pull here may or may not resonate with some of you guys right now. But if you come back and check out some of my messages later, some of these messages that I pulled here for you guys may resonate with some of you guys in the future, okay? So take what's yours today. Whatever's not for you guys collective, please, I ask that you leave this spread and this message for the person who really needs it, all right? Also, you guys, if you have not already please do not forget to hit the like button and subscribe to my channel if you have not already okay um so we're going to go ahead and get into these messages we're going to see what spirit is wanting you guys to know as of today all right so um the first card that flew out for you guys is we have in denial okay we have successful all right, so collective, I definitely feel like you guys have a lot of people right now. You have a lot of people in denial around your, your success, okay? Some of you guys are definitely becoming successful or are successful right now. And I feel like you have a lot of people. We had 111 on the clock that are definitely in denial around your success, okay? Um, look, we have the overthinking card that flew out. And we have your all I think about. So whoever these people are, I feel like... These, you stay on these people mind a lot, okay? I feel like a lot of people are overthinking. You're doing something that's bringing you in a lot of success. Or like I said, you have became successful in some form or way. And I feel like a lot of people are in denial, okay? I feel like you are definitely shocking a lot of people, okay? Um, so I feel like a lot of people are overthinking, okay? They're thinking about whatever this form of success is for you, okay? All right. So um, we have the past lover card that flew out. For some of you guys, this could be a past lover that's definitely doing a lot of overthinking, okay? For some of you guys, I feel like you have someone from your past who is definitely watching you become successful, okay? All right? And I feel like this, this person is doing a lot of overthinking. Like I said, you have a lot of people shocked right now, okay? So whatever it is that you are doing, I feel like a lot of people did not see you in that light, okay? They didn't know you to be this successful person, okay? This is why I feel like a lot of people are in denial, okay? Um, we have the shady friend card that flew out, and we also have the unblock me. So this could definitely be someone who you have blocked. For some of you guys, this could be a past lover or a shady friend, but I feel like for some, for some of you guys, someone still has some form of access to where they're seeing your success, okay? But this is someone you definitely have blocked off, okay? All right. Um, we have the divine feminine card that flew out here. So you, you could be definitely a divine feminine that's very successful right now or definitely on your way to to some form of success. OK, you're doing something. OK, and I feel like you have a past lover and some friend group. OK, I'm definitely picking up a lot of people are able to see you. So you could definitely have some form of platform. All right. Like I said, some of you guys are very successful. Some of you guys are on your way to becoming successful. And a lot of people are in denial of what they are seeing. OK. All right. Um, we have the life path one, which is for leader, create creative and very independent. OK. So like I said, you guys are doing something to where I feel like you're some form of leader. All right, for creative, I feel like you guys are created, creating something, building something. All right, so some of you guys, like I said, could have some form of your own business, okay? Some of you guys are becoming business owners, something you are doing that's successful or is on its way to becoming successful. Has a lot of people shook right now, okay? Whatever it is, I feel like a lot of people are seeing you and viewing you as a leader. And I feel like what's shocking these people is because they never... Why these people are doing a lot of overthinking? Because I feel like you have people who never viewed you in this energy, okay? All right? Um, we have Libra out here that could be significant. And we have Aries, okay? So them could be your signs or this can be someone that's definitely watching you signs, okay? Um, but look what the next card was. We have a family. Look, we have Triggered. For some of you guys, we have the success and wealth. For some of you guys, this is your family, okay? Whatever it is that you are doing that's bringing it in, you in a lot of success and wealth is triggering, excuse me, is triggering for some of you guys, your family, okay? And I feel like why it is triggering these people is because a lot, like I said, including family, a lot of people did not see you as a successful leader. 
So whatever it is that you're doing that's definitely bringing you in success or you're being viewed as a leader is triggering some of your family, okay? I But that's what it is. You being successful and having some form of wealth is triggering them, okay? All right? Um, and this is probably why for some of you guys, look, we have take back charge of your life. So for some of you guys, whatever it is that you're doing, I feel like it's building up your confidence for some of you guys. For some of you guys, whatever you're doing is healing you, all right? And it's allowing you to take back charge of your life, okay? So whatever it is that you're doing, I feel like you have a lot of family members, okay, or family who wanted to have control of your life, okay? I'm picking up a mother figure, okay? But um, for some of you guys, you taking charge of your life is triggering your family in some type of way, certain family, okay? One, someone's not used to you being in control of your life, okay? I definitely feel like you have someone who definitely wants to call the shots on your life, okay? Not knowing you're your own person. So you coming to the forefront as a leader is triggering some family, okay? All right? Look, we have the emotional loss card. For some of you guys, you have family and you, you have a lot of people who are in this energy around feeling like they are in some form of emotional loss because you are taking charge of your life, okay? So for some of you guys, I, I just feel like you have a lot of people that, like I said, are feeling like they emotionally lost because you are now moving forward, you're healing, Okay? Which is does not make any sense to me, but this is what some people are feeling, okay? All right? But look what the next card we have here. We have ancestors. Ancestors are so proud of you, okay? Look, you're on the right path. We have stay positive. Look, we have healing. For some of you guys, I definitely feel like your ancestors are want to let you know that they are proud of you. Because we have 717 on the clock, so you're on the right path. I just definitely feel like you have a lot of people who's trying to make you feel like that you're not on the right path, okay? I feel like you have a lot of people that's projecting how they're feeling because they're triggered, okay, by whatever the success is for you, okay? And I feel like a lot of you guys, you, you have a lot of people projecting their insecurities onto you, okay? All right. So I feel like your ancestors don't want to let you know that they are proud of you. For some of you guys, whatever you are doing is healing you. Also, continue healing. We have stay positive. OK, and you're on the right path. OK, so a lot of you guys, if you are doubting if you're on the right path or not. OK, I'm here to tell you your ancestors are proud of you. You are on the right path. Some of these messages is hidden for me. OK, so. Just know you're on the right path, okay? So we're going to go ahead and pull some cards from the African Goddess Rising. Pull you guys an um, oracle card from there and see what else messages that your um, ancestors and spirit is wanting you guys to know. What do y'all need to know right now? Okay. Just feel like you guys, a lot of people are not used to your success right now. Okay. So we have the, um, we have the speak up card. Okay. All right. So we're going to see what this speak up speaks about. Okay. I feel like this is the perfect card for you guys. Okay. All right. Let's see what this is about. All right. All right. So this card speaks of speak up, speak out, speak on it. You have a right to be heard. Okay. So for some of you guys, you could be doing something where you're speaking up. Okay. You're speaking out. And I feel like this is why this is triggering a lot of people, why a lot of people are feeling some type of way. Because for some of you guys, you are doing something where I feel like you use your voice, okay? And a lot of people are not used to you using your voice. A lot of people are not used to you taking back charge of your life, okay? I feel like a lot of you guys, you never spoke up. 
This is why you're triggering a lot of people. And I feel like whatever it is that you're doing, you're speaking up. Okay? We have, you are betraying yourself by not speaking up. Your words have power. Own your voice. As the old saying goes, stand up for something or fall for anything. Being neutral is not an option. When you stand firmly in your truth, you have thoughts, opinions, beliefs, and convictions, okay? So I just feel like you guys are standing up. That's why to take back charge of your life. You guys are definitely standing up. You're speaking out. And I feel like whatever it is that you're doing is triggering a lot of people, okay? But that has nothing to do with you, okay? For some of you guys, your voice, you've been hiding your voice for too long, okay? For some of you guys, like I said, it's empowering you, whatever you're doing, and it's healing you. All right. This is why your ancestors are so proud of you and they want to let you know that you're on the right path. Keep going. And if whatever this is, is, is healing you, keep keep going towards it. A lot of people are not going to like it, but this is your voice and this is your life. And you have to have to use your voice. Speak up on whatever it is that you need to speak up on. OK. All right. So that's what I have for you collective. Make sure you guys like and subscribe to my channel and I will speak with you guys in a minute. I love y'all. Bye.